What's up, everybody, and welcome one more time here to my channel. I'm Crypto B, and you are on my crypto show. And today, we are diving deep in the world of cryptocurrency to uncover those hidden gems that could potentially explode in the upcoming bull market. So, if you are excited to learn how to prepare to the crypto bull run, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and become part of the family. Press the notification bell because you, my friends, don't want to miss any of my videos that I put up or any of my stream. With no further ado, let's call the intro and get to the video. Before we get started, let's quickly touch on what a bull market is. It's a simple term, it's a period when cryptocurrency prices are on the rise and investors are feeling optimistic about the market future. It's the perfect time to be prepared and potentially make some good gains. The first step in finding hidden gems is research. You need to stay informed about new and promising projects that are arising, especially in times like now. So, Twitter and crypto community. Follow influential figures in the crypto space, join forums, and participate in a lot of different discussions. Check websites and blogs. Keep an eye on reputable crypto news websites and blogs to stay up to date. Place like Reddit and Telegram, cryptocurrency subreddit and Telegram groups can be treasures of information. Make sure to read white paper and roadmap. Dive into those project white paper and roadmap to understand the goals and the vision. And once you have identified a potential hidden gem, it's time to conduct due diligence. Here's what you should consider. Team, who is behind the project? Are they experienced and trustworthy? Technology, does the project offer something unique or innovative? Use case, does the cryptocurrency solve real world problems? Community and social presence, is there a strong community that backing the project? Those are some important questions that you should ask yourself. And of course, diversification, it's a key to managing risk in the crypto market. Don't put all your eggs in one basket. I'm sure you heard this before. So spread your investments across various cryptocurrencies to mitigate potential loss and maximize your gains. Another crucial thing to think about is risk management. It's crucial in the volatile world of cryptocurrencies. Set stop loss orders, only invest what you can afford to lose and resist FOMO. What's FOMO? Fear of missing out. Stick to your strategy and don't let emotions dictate your decisions. To succeed in the crypto market, you must stay informed at the whole time. I basically use my phone and I check for applications that help me with those information. It's either crypto bubbles, crypto information, crypto rank sites, everything that can bring me up to date with the market and the space. The crypto world is ever changing and there is no surefire formula for success. But with research, due diligence, diversification, and risk management, you can increase your chance of finding those hidden gems and making the most out of the next bull run. And now I'm going to share with you guys some projects in the post-chain ecosystem. As you guys know, I really, really like post-chain and I believe post-chain will succeed. And so many projects that are within the ecosystem, of course, is not everything that will succeed. Maybe some project that I show you here today, not even get to the end of the next bull run. But it's important for us to have a look to see if projects allies with our profile of investors, get into the community get into the telegram get into x and make sure that you do your own research to make sure that those projects are projects that you also like and maybe potentially can do a 10 20 50 100 or even a thousand x of course do not take my word as a financial advice i'm just a guy here on youtube sharing with you the things that i like the things that i do and of course as an entertainment purpose only let me share with you my screen. My first project that I believe potentially can do 10, 20, 30, 
maybe even a 50x on the next run is TYRH. This project is empowering post chain with burning, staking, NFTs minting, claiming, yields, and much, much, much more. This is the website over here. Guys, this project have a very, very, very nice uh, gameplay. Let me open the learn here a little bit. So as you can see here, TY, uh, TYRH is an ecosystem by itself. One of the main things of this project is actually burning all RH token. As you can see here, these projects have already burned over 2 billion PLS. 2 billion PLS, guys. 2 billion. I'm going to repeat. 2 billion, 116 million, uh, 56,060 tokens with over $142,000 burned in PLS. Also, $125,000 burn in PLSX and $176,000 burn in HEX and $150,000 burn in Ink Token. Tell me what, what other project has burned more RH token than TY? R8. So that's why I believe this project, guys, is unstoppable. Because as soon as the community understands the amazing thing this project is doing for the RH ecosystem tokens, everybody will run here. Not only you will be burning RH tokens, PLS, PLSX, HEX, and Ink token, but you can be part of this ecosystem. Because as soon as you stake, so as soon as you stake this token, you earn an airdrop of one of those three tokens. You can earn burn token, you can earn plant, or you can earn water. As you can see here, so if I put 1 million token, I can get minimum of 250 million burn token or 275 million water token or 300 million plant token with the plant token you can get into the plantation you can start plant trees the more trees you plant more you're going to be able to harvest in the end and you're going to be able to harvest even more tyrh token with the water you can put in a scene of sea of ink and start burning even more ink token guys this project it's very 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 defy gamify very amazing and i really really like so i strongly believe that tyrh potentially can do another 20 to 50x on the next bull market especially if the community understands the power of these projects at the moment there is over 57 percent of the global stake so everybody who's in the project 57 percent of that is staked because by staking you can earn much 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 more so it's very nice. So you can get here is tyrh.io. You get into the Telegram, to the Twitter, so you guys can follow them and learn much more about the tyrh. And you can see here on the top the tycz adoption lab. They are doing this the same tyrh token at Binance at the Binance Smart Chain. So you can go here and it will be a new project all based on these guys. And the reason why I'm bringing all these hidden gems to you because they are hidden gems because we are right on the beginning crawling towards the bull market. And one of the ways of making money on the bull market is getting there early. And that's why I'm bringing those projects to you. So go and check TYRH or TYCZ. Again, I have videos here on the channel about those two, those two exclusive projects. Go and have a look, okay? So my next project I'm going to talk about is Reflux Token. Reflux is a new token on PostChain. Guys, like everything that I bring to you guys here is projects that I find and I believe to be very interesting, especially if it's to do with passive income, okay? So which kind of project do we love? Ah, we love PostChain, PLS. Yes, we do. We love PLS. What about if you get some projects that you earn PLS in a passive income? So the next projects I'm going to be showing you guys is earning PLS in passive income. How nice is that? Let me tell you guys here, let me share the other screen here. A lot of people don't really like um, 
a tax token or a reflex token. I've been some project in the Binance Smart Chain. Guys, and you will find a lot of projects like this um, on the on the post chain because post chain is amazing. It's cheaper, it's faster, and it's better. So you will find a lot of projects and the importance of understand who is behind the project if that project is is trustworthy. That's the reason why you need to get into the community. So behind this project is the guys from Post Lorian. Okay. I met the founder and I believe they're doing great, great work. They are builders, right? So what they're doing the best, they are building to the community. Also, I have a video about the Post Lorian here on the, on the channel. What is the reflux? What's the reflux token? Well, earn PLS passive income. This for me would be already amazing just by sitting there and earn PLS. Okay. But let's, let's, let's have a look. Reflux interest. Reflux is a hyper deflationary. So let's start here. This token is already is deflationary. So whatever the, 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 the cap was with the supply, it starts to go down, which is amazing. Okay. So it's a deflation, deflationary asset with a 0.25 burn on buy or sell. So there's a tax there, which earns you PLS as passive income via reflection process of 1.75% reflux fee just hold to earn. So the greater the network activity, the higher the PLS rewards. So guys, it's very simple. You you will buy of this token, you're going to hold in your wallet and you're just going to get reflex or you're going to get interest in PLS, in post-chain token. Okay. There is no catch. That's it. The catch is, is a tax token. That's how they pay. For the, that's how they buy the PLS in order to distribution to everybody who is holding the token. Okay. So dedicated yield farming pool. Mm, interesting. Let's click here to go there. Uh, and here how it works. Okay. How, how to earn PLS. So here we go. Let's press play here. As you guys can, I'm sure you guys can see here. So users, you, you buy or sell here, right? On the POSEX, DEX, okay? Or well, let's pause. On buy or sell, 0.25% fee is burned forever. Oh, that's really cool. So 0.25% fee is burned forever. So of the RFX. So that's how it becomes deflationary, right? And 1.75% fee is redistributed as passive income. So basically it's a 2%. So every buy or sell, there's a 2% tax fee on 0.25 of that goes to buy and, buy and burn the RFX right? If I understood correctly. And 1.75% goes to buy a PLS and re redistribute it as passive income in PLS to the holders. So as you can see here, burn is here and then goes to buy 1x share of rewards for holding and users passive income get this over here, right? So let's see a little bit more. Let's pass the video on. All right. So RFX accumulated accumulates on contracts until their holder is reached for distribution. Minimum amount is swapped for PLS at every sell tax to reduce negative price impact. Nice. To incentivize liquidity, pairing POSEX V2. So there is a pair there, this one here on the DEX, RFX uh, to uh, pair to PLS, LP, you earn two Xs. The rewards. Oh, that's cool. So basically, to, to incentivize people to provide liquidity, if you go there, you can provide liquidity for this pair. And in, instead of earning just 1x from by holding your wallet, now you're going to earn 2x reward in PLS. Um, I don't think it's in PLS. Um, I think I was watching the live, the, not the live, the space, and I think you earn a token on a different token, um, but I'll, I'll check that after. Maybe I'll do a live tonight, maybe, and we talk about this token again. Reward is calculated via shares, two shares to LP providers and one share to holders. Yeah, that's that's very cool, guys. I like that. I like that because incentivize 
incentivize people to hold the token, never sell the token, and provide liquidity, correct? That's cool. Uh, oops, here. To further enhance liquidity and stimulate volume via bot arbitrage, there is an option to yield farm where you don't earn PLS. Uh, okay. So, here. But you are uh, you earn post Lauren token Elisis, Elisis, Elisir, Elisir, Elisir. So, to further enhance liquidity and stimulate volume via bot arbitrage, there is an option. An option, nothing is financial advice. You do whatever suits you better. Where you don't earn PLS, so you can put it here and you don't earn PLS, see? so you stake on a vote and you're gonna earn the post Lauren token. And this token, I'm sure you'll be able to do something else with the token as well. Uh, very interesting, guys. I like the, the gamify. I like the gaming file of the project. Uh, it's very interesting for me. Remember this. If, right? If the pie, <laughs> if the pie is tasty, is nice, everybody will want a piece. Everybody will want a piece of the pie, right? So this project, it's new. I think it's very new. They just started, maybe. Let's check here uh, the charts. Let me go here days so they started here on the 13th of october today is the 25th so no long ago so let's see here they did in eight days they did a 545 thousand percent that's not bad not so bad then you see it you see but you can start to see some coins going down Guys, forever, nothing goes up forever. And of course, things get retraced, pullbacks, retraced. It's healthy for projects. 45% down in the next, in the, la, in the last four days. Um, the price now is at 0 0.304. So it's like if you're going back in time here before you have this pump. So this, this kind of project, guys, that <clears throat> if you're going to hold and you need to see if the reward that you are getting, which is PLS, is good enough for you. And if you, you're happy with it, right? And again, don't spend, I'm not saying to spend to put all your money in this or the TYR8. No, you need to check if this kind of project is project that interests you. Um, if it's this kind of project that will, will make you some good gains eventually. But depends if you are also in crypto for the long term or you are here just to flip money. If you're just here for to flip money. And then I don't know uh, because I'm I'm not a trader. I am in, I, I like to invest and hold for the long term. Um, I like this. I like what I see here. By the way, I don't own any of those tokens. Uh, potentially, potentially, like I'm showing you, potentially i will because i want projects that will give me pls um in the long term every you know every i don't know how how is the reflex here but every time i look at my my wallet and i, I see my pls bag growing and growing because i have other projects or all the investments uh, working for me right so just as a recap features two percent of uh Tax fee, as we said before, 0.25% fee burns on, on the buy or sell. It's 1 billion fixed market cap, which is deflationary, start to go down. 1.75% fee paid on PLS reflects to holders outstaking. Uh, so you're just holding your wallet. Hype deflation. PLS uh, passive income dedicated yield farm pool far a fair launch. That's very nice. Um, 2x reflection reward only for V2 PLS uh, liquidity providers. So you have to go to the V2 at the post X DEX and provide liquidity there. Ownership renounced contract cannot be modified. This is very, very nice. They are the same team as post Lorian, which is great. Um, 94% of supply in liquidity, liquidity burn, 6% initial allocation to no expectation of wallets. Okay, so there is a 6% initial allocation here to probably to the team, I suppose. Um, 2x here reward for the LP provider. We talked about that before. This is how you get it. You can check here. Um, there, of course, there's a disclaimer here. 
Um, and also, crypto is extremely risk volatile and has no instrict, uh, intrinsic value. There should be no expectation of financial returns. Uh, of course, guys, you always need to be careful, um, especially with projects with such. Let's see the. Let's see here the liquidity. Liquidity is eighty-seven thousand dollar in liquidity, and the market cap is very, very low. It's four hundred and sixty-seven thousand in uh, in market cap. So that means small. It depends on the amount of um, buys and sell. It, it moves the markets a lot. So it's very volatile. So always be careful with this. Of course, there was the first pump. Uh, let's give them a like here. Let's show the charge again. Like I said before, there of course there is this skyrocket that goes up here, but there always will be a pullback. And then now it's up to the communities to go in. If the communities believe in a project, that's how projects will be sustainable and drive. Um, good luck to the team. I hope you guys do very well. I will look farther on, and I will join you guys also on the Telegram, if I may. Um, I'll, ch I'll check after and I'll join you guys on the Telegram as well. This is Post Lorian. As you guys can see here, this is the farming place where you can farm. Ah, so the, the farm is not on the decks, on the post X. It's actually here on the Post Lorian, right? So it's the postlorian.com lifeline. So you uh, see the other pair, the Elihi uh, token that you earn. Uh, by providing liquidity, you can come here. There's so many pairs that you can also provide more liquidity and earn more and more yields. So here, RFX, WPLS. So the, R, the APR here is 122. That's not bad. That's very good. That's very good. We fee of 2%, as we said before. Um, there's plenty of token here, guys. Guys, the ecosystem of post chain is exploding let me share another token that i really like here and they launched it yesterday is mintra yes mintra launched it yesterday let me share the screen here mintra guys would be the the open sea of post chain okay i know there is others um nft marketplace but mintra uh, launched yesterday they have a staking uh, we, where you also can stake mint and earn PLS in rewards. And I really like that. I think that's really, 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 really cool. Plus, uh, you can create, you have you can create your own project here on NFTs and you can mint over here. You can um do the whole process of creating the NFTs and put out for minting everything here. It's like um um, everything, all things, NFTs, the Mintra project. And here's where you put um, your tokens, but uh, to, to stake, so you can stake and earn PLS. Let me go here. There is a, let me go to the analytics over here. So as you guys can see here, these are the statistics. As you can see here, there is a lot of staking, a lot of um mint staking as you can see also the 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 mint supply are deflationary so it's going down right and mint burning over time and people are burning a lot of mint as well very very nice very neat congratulations to the team this is a very nice project i like a lot so uh just for disclaimer I, I do hold mint uh, myself, just for disclaimer, and I also have staked. Um, I like, I want to see, because I want to receive PLS in rewards, of course, right? Okay, for my next two projects, they have not yet been launched, but I strongly believe on their potential. Can all these projects, by the way, I forgot to mention, but all these projects I'm talking about here, they have potential of another 10 20 up to 50x guys they are new on a new chain and potentially they can do very very good they're gonna do good we don't know but potentially they have very very strong potential to do good my next project is nine inch nine inch is the rock hard deck. it's a dex right with a lot of very cool stuff here 
uh, Hex Bastard, yesterday he did another live with Crypto Coffee and they talked about 9inch. So 9 is not launched yet. So the next two projects I'm going to tell, 9inch and Liquid Loan, they have not launched yet, but they are probably like very, very, very soon. And remember what I said from the beginning? One of the ways of making money in crypto is being early. And that's why I am bringing 9inch here for you guys to go and have a look. So go into the X and you can type 9inch.io and you guys can go and check for the project and see how everything works. Check all the, the decks. Let me, let me share with you guys here. I think it's on the test net. So basically, this is 9inch. Right? Grow your holding. Nine Inch is the DEX yield farm designed to penetrate the mainstream crypto market. Create as a post-concentric platform where you earn reward by providing liquidity and stake your favorite token. And engage in open DEX with exciting yield farm opportunities await you. Launching very, 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 very soon. They're going to have two tokens. The Nine Inch token is the main asset of the DEX. It's deflationary by nature. It has a fixed supply at launch. Use the 9-inch token to earn juicy rewards, rewards by staking and participating in the best yield farming. 9-inch is also the DAO token to the platform. Holders decide which projects again project gets privilege listed in yield farming staking pools. BBC Big Bonus Coin is exactly what the name suggests. A bonus coin that you earn as a reward on the 9-inch platform. You earn BBC by staking other assets in single staking pools and by providing liquidity and using your LP in the farming pools. By the way, 9-inch gonna have a single staking POSEX. Ah, that's nice. I like that. Single stake POSEX. Amazing, huh? Very nice. And my next project is the everybody, a lot of people are waiting for Liquid Loan. I love Liquid Loan. 0% uh, interest fee, DeFi, boring protocol, asset backed, backed stable coins, low 110% collateral ratio, no repayment schedule, immutable governance free, no admin key. Guys, I love Liquid Loan. And I think Liquid Loan is going to do very well. Why? It's backed by uh, Postchain, PLS. If PLS does 100x, which I believe it will, 100x, right? Not financial device. I also believe that Liquid Loan will follow potentially to 100x. It will do that. I don't know. Potentially, maybe. Right, but it's definitely a project to keep your eyes on. Zero percent interest fee, DeFi liquidity for car buyers. Liquid Loan is the first truly decentralized lending protocol built specifically for posting. Fully backed stable coins, low 110 percent collateral ratio, no repayment schedule, immutable, governance free, no admin key, and I will stake all my loan token. As simple as that. This is here. Look, this is how it works. Borrow, earn, redeem, stake again. Borrow, earn, redeem, stake again. I think they're going to do very well. Um, borrow, lock up your existing PLS and mint your USDL loan token. Um, USDL loan. Redeem, unlock one USD worth of PLS for one USDL in the future, if you choose. Stake, stake loan to earn USDL and PLS from the borrowing fees revenue and earn, prov and earn provide USDL to the stability pool for loan and PLS rewards. That's very nice. I like that. I'm going to try to do all that with my, with my loan token. Uh, I like and potentially... All these projects that I just mentioned, let me open here. Potentially, not financial advice, but all these projects that I have um, mentioned here today, potentially they have, they can uh, do between 10, 20, 30, maybe 50x on the next run. Uh, if they will, I don't know. And then goes back to what I said right on the beginning of the video. You need to do your own research. You need to get into the community. You need to speak to the founders. You need to get involved. You need to leave cryptocurrency. You need to be around the space. And like that, decide for yourself if that is something that aligns with your profile of investors. If you found this video valuable, 
If you like the content, smash the like button, subscribe to the channel and become part of the family. Here like this, you help me to grow my community. And of course, you encourage me to create more and more content like this just for you. I'll see you guys on another video or maybe in another stream. And happy, happy investing.